All right, what's up everybody? In this video, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna install this ceiling fan slash light setup. I already took it out of the box. This is the box that it came in and it kind of has like a little description on it. You know, it's got high air blowing. It's got a dimmer, so it's got 10 levels of dimming and it's got like a timer on it. The cool thing that I like about it, it's very quiet and it has a remote control with it. I took it out of the box and I read the instructions to see everything that I need to install it. This is what you get with it. You're gonna get this little hardware kit, a bracket, and the ceiling fan right here, you can kind of see over it. It has a LED light that goes around right there. And the wiring looks fairly simple. It's got a three wire setup. So I went ahead and I'm gonna show you where I'm gonna install it. So I have the setup which has two wires right there. So it looks fairly simple to install. I went ahead and took this down just to look at it. So let me go ahead and install it now and show y'all exactly what it looks like. And then I'll cover all the settings and all that here in a minute. So let's do, let's get to install. All right, there it is everybody. I just installed it. You see how it works there? There's an inside turning like wind fan and then there's a fan behind it I don't know if you can hear it in the camera so everything that I needed to make this work was I needed a flat head screwdriver a Phillips head screwdriver a drill set my drill some wire cutters some electrical tape and I used a sharpie for marking where that bracket went it took me a total of about 30 minutes and you need a little bit of insulation skills to install this but I did it fairly quick and then I have the remote here and I'm not gonna install that but you could screw that into the wall and it gives a place to like hang the remote but I'm just gonna put the remote beside the bed here and then you get a little set of instructions that break down the remote but let me show you how this thing works. So watch this so right now I'm on kind of a white light there's a dimmer you can see it dimming and it gets pretty dim right there and you see that inside rotating right there watch this now that's off and now it's just blowing the fan straight down and then there's three settings. Right now I have it on the, e, the like the lowest. That's number two. And that's number three. And that feels really good. That's blowing really hard right there actually. Let me put it back on one. And then you can see I could turn the light all the way up. So that's max brightness. Now hit this button in the center right here. Now it has more like a warm, cool lighting like that. And then once again, you've got adjustment to bring it all the way down. And then if you want to stop the fan right here is a stop on the fan. The fan's turned off. Hit that center button again. Now I've got kind of like a really bright inside light right there. And then hit it a third time and then it goes out. This right here kind of turns the brightness. It kind of cycles through the way you want. You can see right there, like down and up, which I think that's uh, Calvin. So if you want to like go minus K or up K, you just kind of turn that down. And you can see it works really well. The remote section is behind the fan, but right here, you can see I'm pointing straight down into bed and it's working Very just fine. Very impressive. It was nicely packaged, really easy to install. Good instructions, has a remote to it. This is something I recommend for anyone that's just kind of wanting to upgrade to a more modern ceiling fan. So yeah, that's all I got today, everybody, on the ceiling fan slash LED light. See you in the next video. Let's keep cool. There you go.